what am I going to do today? What do I do every day? Today I know what I'm doing. It's going to be 79 degrees and I got to get out there and tackle all these weeds and mow the dog's yard. At the very least, I'll probably mow everything. If it doesn't rain, and I'm not real sure, I've just woke up. I ain't looked at the forecast. There is a chance of rain, uh, but it may not. When it says it's going to rain here, it usually don't. <laughs> they never get it right. But I think it's important if you're retired, whether that be by choice or you reach retirement age and retired, man, you got to stay busy. You can't sit on your butt every day and surf the internet and watch YouTube videos. You got to get out and do something. If you don't do that, you're going to freeze up and then you ain't going to be able to do nothing. So I try to get out there and keep some projects going. I mean, the shop has kept me pretty busy uh, the last month. Um, once a week, I go grocery shopping. You know, it may not be the same day every week because I'm trying to break routines. When you get into routines, that's like working, man. That reminds you because you get up every day, you go to work. You do the same things every single day with the only exception being your weekends or your days off. And I don't want to live like that. I want to do what I want when I want. And that's important. But I do know today that that yard work, because of the heat, and this usually happens every year, there'll be weeks at a time I can't do anything outside because it's too hot. That's why I've been working out in that shed because it has, you know, it's got a nice air conditioner in it, so I'm not out in the heat. I could work in the house and do things, but that's new. That's more exciting to me than working in this house. So, and it's something that when I finish... I'm going to be able to do a lot of projects in there. So I've been motivated to get that done. But you need to, you know, have several projects. And I don't like to, you know, like I say, the only day I really am committed to is going to get groceries, dog food. Um, I could buy more at one time and only do that trip couple times a month but it gets me out of here it keeps me sane so it, it is kind of nice once a week to know that I, I can go to I'm gonna go on this little mini trip and anything you might need you pick up while you're out um, but you got to leave some days open you know doctor's appointments things like that I don't commit I don't commit to nothing anymore because that just makes life a lot more enjoyable. Um, when you don't have to look at a calendar and say, well, I can help you on this day, or I can do this on this day. I can pick a day. But I have to make a few day trips, long day trips soon. Uh, I need to go visit parents and family in Tulsa. So that's going to be get up very early, drive. It's a, it's a, it's not it's not terribly far. It's three hours away. So I'm thinking get up at, leave you know really early. Get there early, leave early. Um, in the summer, these dogs are not eating until six, seven in the evening. Uh, rooster. As long as she gets to go out in the morning, she is good all day. She could care less if I'm home. She'll sit in my recliner and sleep. So it's nice to have a little trip you can take once in a while. Uh, I have no interest in traveling, getting on airplanes, doing any of that. I've done plenty of that when I was younger. Um, I've seen all I need to see. I'm sure I haven't seen a sliver of what's out there, but I just, I don't, I don't care to be around groups of people. The last thing I would enjoy would be going to some event where there's thousands of people. I, no way would I do that these days. Because people are crazy today. They are crazy. You see that? I'll tell you what I'm crazy about. I'm crazy about this coffee. 
I hope that microphone's not picking up my belly because I haven't had breakfast and it's grumbling. So today I'm getting out and I'm getting some work done. I got to put on pants, man. I haven't put on pants in two months. Been wearing shorts. Yeah, so I got to put on pants and, the, and my muck boots because you don't want to step in muck and you don't want to get snake bit. And I'm walking through some pretty tall weeds back there, but old boss I work for said, you know, at the ranch, he said, if you don't worry about snakes, they're not worried about you, you won't see them. And that's true. If you're worried about them, you're going to have trouble with them. Well, I attempted to take that microphone apart and fix it yesterday. Didn't work. Had to get a order another one. And that will be here tomorrow. I mean, this seems to work fine. It's just not the same as having a good quality microphone. I mean, it is a good quality microphone. But it's not the same. Uh, I like having the headphones where I can hear what's going on with my voice. That way in editing, I don't have much to do when it comes to audio. Uh, a, lot of, a lot of people realize, oh, YouTubers, you just record it and you put it on YouTube. Now, there's a lot more to it than that, especially if you're using other programs like I'm using. Now, this uh, OBS program that I use for these podcasts, very simple. Uh, I hit record, you know, and then I hit stop recording. And then it's already in an MP4 format. Okay, so I just go into my editor and it uploads really quick. Um, it, it creates. What you have to do is you go in, you edit, then you click create. It turns it into MB, MP4 uh, format and then you upload it to YouTube. Well, it's already in it. So... The saving part of the video file is so much quicker. And, and there's a lot of features on this. I haven't even scratched the surface yet. We'll get there. Um, yesterday's video, I took one of my old videos uh, off my other channel to show you a clip. And it had music from Epidemic Sound in it, which I don't subscribe to anymore. And... They unmonetized it. So the only choice I had was to let them mute that section, which kind of rendered the whole clip useless uh, because you couldn't hear me talking and telling what I was seeing. But that's what happened yesterday. So I got to be aware when I do things like that about the music. It didn't even dawn on me because it was my own video. But because it's on this channel and they're hearing that music on this channel, then they require me to be a subscriber. I don't know how these other channels do it because, I, like, I watch Casper's site. He's he's playing these other people's videos. He can't subscribe to everybody's music service. Uh, I'm not even using the music services anymore. My editing program has a whole big library full of music. Um, so I'm, I'm focusing more on the videos than the music. But there's plenty of music on there. I'm already paying for that service. So I'm going to start using that. Uh, a lot of people don't care about the music, but they're, they're, if you're trying to make a good video, music has to be in it for certain things you're trying to do. Um, if I'm trying to do something funny, or I'm showing the dogs, it helps to play, you know, dog music. Silly music. You know, make just makes it more interesting, I think. But I'm going to start using, you know, who, 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 Wondershare. That's who I use for my editing program. They got a whole bunch of music in there. I didn't ever know that before. Sometimes you just got to get on these programs and just start digging in there. Seeing what it's got. Click on this. What's this do? Click on it. Okay. And then you ain't going to usually remember what it did and where it was. You know, but over time, you get used to it. So, yeah, nothing irks me more than when I put a video out and YouTube comes back and says, you know, you can't do this, you can't do that. I hate that. Um, this copyright, I understand why copyrights are in place, but in today's day and age, uh, you know, 
What 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 are they gonna copyright in the future? Everything? It's crazy, man. It's crazy. So I am getting ready to put some pants on, get on out there. Every morning you gotta wait because it's got the morning dew on there. Because this summer it's been going down. It's uh seventy two right now. So it goes down and you get that dew on the ground. The humidity's really high. And uh but today's only gonna be seventy nine. So I imagine the yeah, the humidity's ninety one percent. Well hey man, sweat don't kill nobody. It's the excessive heat and we're not gonna have that for actually for the next several days. Uh, probably gonna I got a new e-bike I have to do a review on. I kind of bolted on them. They sent me the bike and then I quit doing videos. I stayed in touch, but I quit doing videos, said I'll get to it. So I think maybe tomorrow I'll saddle up that bike on the other channel. We'll take it for a ride and I can and get that out of the way. There's actually another bike that uh I got to do one more video. Some of them require two videos. Some of them require one. Um, I'm only going to do reviews on products of stuff that I can use. Uh, you know, but otherwise you're going to get a garage full of stuff. I mean, there's tons of e-bikes out there. <laughs> I'm keeping them, man. Hey, I like them. I just got to load them up in the truck and take them out and go enjoy them. Because really around where I'm at, it's kind of dangerous riding them. That highway's not super busy, but it's busy enough to where you you got to really watch over your shoulder. That's why I got the mirrors. So I don't have to watch over my shoulder. But usually those mirrors suck that they got for them bikes. You can't see nothing with them. I don't know what they're designed for. Little tricycles for kids? I don't know. All right, well, I got to get to work. Let's get this uploaded, and we will see you tomorrow. There was something else, and I can't remember what I was going to say. I don't know. Just, you know, when the video comes out, watch it. That's all I can say. And I got to say that the likes, the other, like on the first video, the video the day before yesterday on this channel, that really did well. And I noticed when I was getting more likes the the video would do better so that does help the alpo rhythm so give me a like give me an unlike i don't care thanks for watching happy trails